Hi, right, today's video regarding Canon Pixima TS3300 series printer. So I'm going to show you how to use this printer for the wireless printing and scanning. So first we need to connect this printer with our smartphone using a Wi-Fi network of your home or office. Now download the Canon print app from the app store. And once you download it, now we open the Canon print app. Now it will ask you a question, do you want to search for available printers? So we need to add a printer here. So click on yes. So it's possible you will see this screen here. And now you need to click on if printer cannot be found button. And click on auto connection. Now we need to press and hold this button for 3 seconds on the printer screen. So now on the printer screen press and hold the smartphone button for 3 seconds. And now we click on next. Now here we can see it shows up the name of the printer and we click OK. Now you will see the name of the wireless uh, network here so you just have to click yes. Now enter the wireless password and you will see in the final end you will see the confirmation screen. And in the end you will see this screen where you get the scan and copy and uh, print document option. So let's start with the scanning. So open the top scanner. Place a page facing downwards on the left hand corner. Close the lid. And now click on the scan icon. And here you can change the settings if you want it a JPEG or if you want it in a PDF. If you uh, want uh, to change the color if you want it black and white. And then click on scan. So here you can see it has successfully transferred the scan. Now I'll show you how to do the wireless printing with it. So we just go back on the main screen and place the pages at the rear tray for the print and take the output tray out. Now click on print document section. Select any PDF or document. Now click on next and select the page range and you can also have option for the number increase the number of copies if you want it black or color and once you do that click on the print button and just wait for the print So that's the way we can use this printer easily for the wireless printing and scanning. Now although this printer is uh, doing wireless printing and scanning, it's quite slow in the connection when you are going to connect it with the Wi-Fi and it might be possible it won't go through once. You might have to try it few times and then you can use it easily. Thanks for watching.